to transformation. It's... It... I'm... I'm turning into a werewolf under the full moon! I must embrace my inner power! What the heck are you doing? <laughs> oh, you know, I'm just pretending to be like a werewolf. It's four in the morning! Well, becoming a werewolf has been a crazy popular response to the question I asked, what would you like to see in the next Elder Scrolls Online video? And frankly enough, many people just don't know how to do this. Becoming a werewolf by no means is a quick process and will take a long time, unless you're just lucky and everything just falls into place, of course. Now, before I give you the secret to becoming that big hairy brute, there's a few things that we need to discuss. They are brutal, they are hard to kill, and worst of all, they do not shower. Now, most people just jump on the hype train yelling, Oh boy, gee whiz, I'm a cool cat werewolf. Yet little do they realize they've also jumped onto the hype train of pain. There are pros and cons to becoming a werewolf, and you're gonna have to decide what you really want. Fragland didn't decide. Guess where he is. First off, as a werewolf, you will become more powerful than other people. You will strike fear into the hearts of all your fellow Essors. You will be given more health, armor, stamina, speed, and attack strength, which is all you could really ask for. Your attacks will become much quicker. You will always have the chance of making your enemies bleed out. But now for the part that no one wants to hear. Werewolf fans, cover your ears and eyes. Being a werewolf makes you extremely susceptible to fighter's guild skills. Whenever you come up against enemies using fighter's guild skills, they will deal you much more damage. And not only when you're a werewolf, also, you will be dealt quite a bit more poison damage. Okay, this one isn't so bad unless you come up against enemies with bows, because there is a very high chance that they will use poison attacks. What are we hunting today, Humphrey? Uh, the usual. Rabbits, deer, werewolves. You thinking what I'm thinking? Poison. Now that we've gotten that lame part out of the way, it's time to show you all what you actually came for! To become a dance werewolf! I meant to say werewolf! So, there are currently two ways to become a werewolf in this game. One way makes you decide your fate. To become that legend that everyone fears. To seek out the power that will strike into the hearts of your enemies. The journey that will change the outcome of your destiny! And the other way I can compare it to a fast food drive through Hey there, welcome to Esso Burgers. What can I get you today? Yeah, I'd like a burger. Nothing on it. Fries? Oh no, maybe a salad. Hold the lettuce. Is that all for you, sir? Yeah, yeah. Ah, oh, what the heck. Throw in a good old werewolf infection while you're at it. Oh, sir, you crack me up! <laughs> Soon I'll be cracking spines. So the easy way to become a werewolf is simply by asking a real player who's already been turned into a werewolf. You must be bitten by them near a ritual site, and they're only allowed to bite people every seven days. That's why you're constantly seeing messages like, Ugh, you stupid idiot! You were supposed to infect me! Are you serious with me right now? I have been on this game for seven days straight, and nobody has bitten me yet? I just want to know how to cook. Now this next part, well, it might scare the younger audience. Why? Well, simply because no one has patience anymore! Okay, before I start, there's something super important for you all to know. In order for this to work, you must be in a level 37 to 44 region. For the Daggerfall Covenant, that would be Bancori. For the Eldermary Dominion, that would be Reaper's March. And for the Ebonheart Pact, that would be the Rift. Now it is time for you to make that great journey, and travel across the land, searching far and wide. And remember, if you fight them at night, under a full moon, the chances of you getting scratched are much, much higher. You finally managed to have one scratch you, and you are now infected with the werewolf. You are now ready to start your quest as a werewolf. You will be greeted by somebody at the main city of that region who will start you on your quest to either become a guy who... You know, I feel like running across Tamriel is a big beast today. Whoa, 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 I didn't read the small print here. Hold on just a second. And all you kids out there have to remember, there's one thing you can't do as a werewolf, and that is... 